hi all so today in this video we are going to see about another we are going to start a new POC that is called medical test uh, application so in this POC what we are going to see here is that doctors will be able to add new patients in the system okay so you can see here this is the summary page for the doctor okay and this is the add button which is there uh, one action has been there to add a new patient so from here uh, the doctor will be able to add the new patient when they added the patient it will show in the below grid okay for example let's try to add a patient okay so this is the window which will open to add the patient you can see here okay so let's add a patient here William James something like this and then we will have the email I enter the email ID of the uh, patient okay let's enter the phone number of the patient and then we will enter age and then gender okay so once we have entered all the details of the patient one new patient will get added in our system let's refresh it so here you can see William James has been added in the system okay the, okay the doctor can also like uh, we also give the f uh, uh, ability to update the any uh, further details if, if we want to update okay for example William 123 at the rate so that also we can do it okay so now you can see here in the let, let me refresh the record huh so in the uh, email here you can see the email ha ID has been updated okay now uh, once uh, the doctor can also go inside the uh, summary view uh, for a particular patient they can see all the details of the patient okay and from here as well they can they can be able to update uh, update the patient from here as well they can update a given patient after that the basic uh, uh, summary details of the patient is showing which was showing there okay and one more thing is there is the test result the doctor should be able to add a test result for the patient so for here we have an action here to add the test result initially you can see here test type uh, status date tested everything is showing but there are no item available so let's uh, add a test for the patient okay so here uh, automatically you can see here when we click on add test then the name of the patient is showing William James okay and what test we want to add for the patient that we can select here for example we can say like a, a blood test count we want to uh, add for the patient okay now once uh, blood test count has been added for the patient you can see here initially uh, the test type will get added uh, here okay and initially the status is pending okay and automatically the date of today will it will take it okay and if we want to update like uh, now after that the user will get an email that uh, this test has been ordered by your doctor okay once it is uh, like uh, received you will get the updated email as well like that okay and then if we want to update the test result like doctor has got the updated report then from the test result you can see here the previous name is coming here the uh, patient name is coming okay as and the test type is blood test count but doctor would not be able to edit that test report now okay and now the test status which was pending initially now we can change this to normal high and low okay let's say it is high blood test count is high because a medical report like it can be high low so basic uh, 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 approach we have taken here like a state uh, report can be low or high or normal okay so it is above uh, it is high which is not normal okay let's click on submit and now we can see that the status will get updated here as high okay now this was about the first type like what doctors would be able to do here okay now after that the in the uh, we we can be able to like one patient can have multiple tests okay let's say like we wanted to add another test for the doctor so or not for the patient kidney test that also we can add it okay so there is no restriction like only one or two test can be added multiple tests uh, multiple tests can be added okay and from here as well we can go and update that uh, test okay so let's say kidney test was ordered and now it is a bit of normal okay so here we can have the status of normal as well okay now the second uh, 
copies that we have it as a record like here we will have the count of all the uh, names of the patient and their test type recent test like what they have done for example you here you can see William James is written two times because just now we have added two tests for the him one was kidney test and another was a blood test count one status was high one status was normal and here as well uh, the record link is given here so which will take us to that particular uh, uh, user summary page here okay so that also we can do from here and the third type which is added in our site is the reports type so doctor should be able to view like how many total tests has been done okay for example 25 percent kidney test was there 25 percent diabetes test blood test count 50 percent and these charts are linkable so if you click on that chart you will get like all the patient for whom this blood test was has been uh, ordered so you can see smith james olivia william just these patients were added uh, the blood test count okay and if we go in diabetes test so we will get the names like james and olivia has diabetes test okay and for the kidney test as well uh, smith and william james has opted for the kidney test similarly here this is a report by the test type how many people have opted a kidney test diabetes test and this one and this is the uh, chart for the uh, you can say uh, status like how many have low how many have patients have currently having the high statuses and how many patients are having the normal statuses okay so this is based on that count okay so we will try to make this uh, poc from scratch okay understanding all the components and this whole poc is based on the record approach of appian okay so everything here is a record we won't be using any cdt okay we will be able the we will be able to learn lot of things in this poc like records relationships okay some generic interfaces rules as well okay so a lot of learning is there okay so what we will do here is we will try to start this okay so that's all in this as of now thank you